This is Georgetown, the capital city of Guyana. It was regarded as the garden city of the Caribbean. President Dr. Irfan Ali says he is on a mission, one aimed at restoring the city to its former glory. To do this, significant investments are being made to restore the vibrancy of the city. President Ali detailed the plan during his address at a recent event in Georgetown. The government has been investing massively in this city. And we are now working on an investment in this city that will be different. We are working with the King's Foundation. And what do we hope to achieve in the near future in this city? We are hoping not hoping it will be done. Not, there's no hope in this. We are working on building a city that will be connected on a number of pillars. One, culture and heritage. So we want, when visitors come, they must walk from Kingston all the way around the city and be able to enjoy the culture and heritage of the city. That means we have to rebuild all our heritage facilities. We have to clean up the city, do back all the drainage, make the drainage economically viable by putting in modern drainage facility in which you can have parking over the drainage, in which we can create cycle lane over the drainage, in which we can create greenery, greenery along the drainage, and peaceful, tranquil, safe walking circuits throughout the city. So another sector in the city development plan is the city parks connectivity. How smooth and seamless you can move from park to park, including the work that we will do on creating a modern facility at the Botanical Garden and the zoo. Connecting that to the National Park, connecting that to the boardwalk. And I know the City Council is also looking at a project for the modernization of some of the markets. Because the markets must be reflective of the culture, must be reflective of the history, must be safe, must be usable, must be friendly. Altogether, President Ali said the development will bring world-class development to Guyana. All of these sectors and segments that we see the city evolving with will support a city that is people-centric, moving more towards a walking city, a riding city, with less vehicle traffic coming into the city, encouraging greater wellness and family orientation with family using the city, walking together. Reporting for the newsroom, Sharda Bacchus.